listening to the talk. My name is Kyla Himban. I'm 14 years of age. I'm from Uret, Pacific province of Papua New Guinea. I have three questions regarding King Tuna Talk. Is tuna the most important family of fish for national consumption and economic benefit in the Pacific? Thank you, Papua New Guinea, for this very interesting question. Tuna is a very important fish. It provides more than half of national income in some of the Pacific countries through excess fees. The export value of tuna is also very huge in our region. Tuna fishery in the Western Central Pacific is the largest in the world, with an estimated catch value of close to US $6 billion. Thank you. How do you evaluate the status of the tuna stock in the Pacific? Thank you, Papua New Guinea, for your thoughtful question. We determine the status of tuna and other fish species through a process called stock assessment. A team of scientists working with stakeholders throughout the region combines all the catch and biological sample information on tuna species and these other fish species. These data are then matched with the historical patterns of catches in the region. By doing this, we can manage tuna catches at an appropriate fishing level. How does climate change affect tuna migration in the Pacific? Thank you for your question, PNG. Um, it's a very hard question, actually. Um, there's a lot we're not sure about when it comes to climate change and tuna. So um, we, we know tuna are very sensitive to the environment, so sea surface temperatures and things like that. Um, but we don't quite know how the, this is going to affect them in the future. So um, I guess at this stage, as far as we know, we think there could be quite large changes in the migration of tuna in the future. Um, and one of these kind of effects is there might be a bit of an eastward shift in um, certain species. So there could be quite large changes in the distribution in coming years.